Time is the most precious commodity, but at the same time, human development and helping the human race improve, mankind improve, and particularly in issues which don't get the attention they deserve. People talk a lot about the financial sector and the economy, but really what drives all this is human capital. And to develop human capital, you need healthcare, you need education, you need skills, and much more. So the reason all of us put in the time and effort in this Emerging Market Symposium is because we can improve the human capital of the world at large and in, of developing countries in particular. Emerging markets are a very popular group of countries at the moment because they have higher growth rates, they have more reform, more opportunities to develop and grow, but they also have many challenges. And one of the major challenges in emerging markets as we discovered, were the human development side. So this program started three years ago, and we started the process by focusing on healthcare. Healthcare is a big field, but what we do here in these seminars or symposium is bring in experts from the world. And the draw of Oxford University and Green and Templeton College is very strong. Most people want to come on their own, and they want to give us the time, and our role here is to get people to come together, share their experiences, share their knowledge, combine it, combine practical experience with academic knowledge and research, and come out with suggestions which the world at large can benefit from. Ladies and gentlemen, the only constant in life today is change. I think the Emerging Market Symposium has uh, certainly exceeded my expectations. At the same time, we need to do more and more. Now, one of the key drivers of this symposium is the sponsor, CNC Alpha. They, have, they gave us money to get the program going, and we could then attract all the right people to contribute to this effort. Secondly, I think we could be brought in quality people. If you look at the people who come, 40 to 45 people for every seminar once a year, you will get area experts, you will get academics, you will get researchers, and people who can then share with each other. And what we have done now is uh, expanded our ability to communicate the end results to the constituents and to the world at large. So we use the media a lot. There were articles published in 40 countries about our program on healthcare and health in the last two sessions. And now we are fo focusing on education. And in education, you need primary education, secondary education, and you need tertiary education. And we are uh, very excited that we are looking at the education part because really illiteracy is a major challenge in the world. And lack of education can lead to a lot of problems. And having education can lead to a lot of opportunities. And that's the focus in the current seminar. I go to a lot of conferences, uh, one or two a month actually, around the world, in different parts of the world, and I get the opportunity to interact with many people. I can say uh, with authority that this group, the group we assemble here for the subjects we have at hand, is world class. And that contributes to the quality of the output and the credibility of the output. I think uh, EMS uh, in my view, is a great initiative taken by the Green and Templeton College and the Oxford University. We must continue this because for very modest cost, we get tremendous impact and tem tremendous quality of output. And uh, as you can see, the surroundings are very professional and good, but simple. And we, uh, we do take care of our guests, but we keep it very simple. We focus on content. We focus on bringing the best in the world, and it's all volunteer work. We, people really spend their own time, people spend their own expenses in most cases, and the sponsors really help provide the fabric which brings all of us together. So my own view is that uh, this effort, coupled with some reasonable amount of fundraising, can produce huge dividends for the world at large and the emerging markets in particular.